original 1948 fleet line. Original AM radio, and we've done a uh, complete restore on the case. Uh, new uh, full range 6x9 DVC stereo speaker in it. It has four channels out, 45 watts a channel. Two here, two you use somewhere else. It also has a set of pre-outs on the side over there if you want to add an amp to a set of rear speakers or even put a sub in. Uh, AM FM Stereo Auxiliary that In. That is brand new music from uh, the We've repolished everything the on here and these are brand new push buttons. Now these are not my knobs. I don't think I got the knobs with the radio. Tomorrow, And uh, what we had to do was change out the potentiometer in there which is your volume and off and on switchers. Uh, the one that was in it was in pretty bad shape. So uh, we changed that out. Now you have full time active toner instead of a toner switch. Presented by Super. That means you can watch. You don't have to switch it. Way, you can go from treble to bass just by moving it. Trailblazing a journey of musical diversity. 89.5 WMO. Now it has an auxiliary in, which is automatic. Get a two piece cable, one that looks like this, you can hide. And a mail to mail cable, plug in any device you want to. And, uh,. Somebody tell me what's the reason. Don't it has voice ID, which is real neat in the AM radio. And we'll scan stations for you. And we're going to demonstrate a little of it. Right now you're on FM. And anytime you want to know where you're at, AM dial, FM station. Go one, two, three. FM 89.5. She tells you where you're at. If you want to put it in scanning mode and let it find your station just by taking the tuner knob and look twice, back and forth. Scanning for stations. Now it's going to start scanning for stations without the needle moving. I'm going to let it run a few stations and then I'm going to show you how to find it, how to lock in on that station to even find it. And then we're going to show you how to do the presets. A lot of people don't know about how to do the presets on these radios. Yeah. And by Sauce Labs, helping developers build digital applications that work exactly as they should on every browser. Out of tarnation power. Well, get your duds off. Time you wash up supper will be on getting cold. Well, I'll take care of supper out to it first. Supper? Oh. I do. I do. Now, you are in the minority. Most Still people don't think this station. Okay? I just want to warn you. Okay, a little suspense there. Do you have it? I love And uh, we all got injured pretty good. I knew I had to do one more. what was right for my family. So I called Hughes and Coleman. We're good. But what he did have was a... So you like that station. You, this is the one you normally listen to. Yeah. yeah. All you do is turn it once. Station hold. She'll lock on it. She says that. Wait, not a smoke lap. FM. Scanning for stations. We'll try that again. What are you gonna do? Talk to me. As I'm talking, you can shut off the whole rest of this message, and you and God can have a conversation. And His invitation, His condition to you, come right now. So you like that station there? You turn it once. Station hold. Now, so she says that. You won't find it. Just start moving. And when you come up on it, it'll go dead. When you come up on that station, then you can lock on it. The way you do preset is a little bit of case underneath here. You just pull that down and lift that push button up like that. And that little deal pops out, pull it out. And we're going to set that station up there. All you do is unscrew it a little bit, push it all the way in to move the cam, let it back out, and then tighten it up. Hold your button up, push it in, and then lock your button back down. Trying to grab a quick. That's how you set your presets up.
888 Three years or 36,000 miles of coverage. You preset your presets up maintenance. like that. Hyundai, the longer you look. Tip number one. I'll go back down there or I won't get in trouble. Style intact. <laughs> it doesn't say. Well, go to AM radio, just turn the radio off and right back on. AM radio, want to know which station? One, two, three. AM 650. Off and right back on, takes you right back to FM. One, two, three. FM 89.5. Now, this little deal in the center here, we got it rigged up. Now, your lights are going to come on with your... Uh, dash light. You have an orange wire in here to wire up. But it goes through this little fader so when it's on at night you want to turn that light down or leave it up. You can. That's a cool little feature they done back in them days. Now also in your uh, your fader control, which is full time, you have balance and fader in your uh, toner control. I probably said that wrong. Uh, you have a stereo speaker here, so the full range two cone is stereo channel. You don't want to mess with uh, balance because you've got two in the back, you wouldn't know you've done anything. But you might want to know how to fade it. That way you can bring your back speakers up. And there's an easy way to do it. All you do is take the treble back a little bit and pump it twice clockwise. Fader adjust. There's your ears. There's your front. That dead air you're hearing there tells you it's a center, that's balanced out. There's that speaker. There's them speakers. Fader set. Stop moving it, she'll set it back on treble and bass. You also have loudness, EQ, and crossover in here. All you do is take it back just a little bit. Let's go counterclockwise three times. Let's turn our loudness and our EQ on. Buzzing on, not long. Loudness off. EQ off. One more time. Yo, my king, loudness on. One more time. EQ on. There you go. Well, I can buzz, baby. Now, in your instructions, it's going to show you how to actually get in there and change it. We're going to set up, say, uh, I'm going to run through the menu one time. I'll try not to change too much. Back it back up. Go one, two, three. EQ on. Clockwise move. EQ adjust. Clockwise move. Treble adjust plus four dB. Now, we're going to set our treble up to where we want it. Just stop moving, she'll set it. Treble set plus 8 dB. Clockwise. Treble adjust. Clockwise. Mid adjust plus 3 dB. I don't like a lot of mids. Mid set plus 1 dB. Ramps offered through community colleges. Mid adjust plus Base adjust plus one dB. Figure out how to work at the last days. Though the earth may pass away, your word remains the same. Base set zero dB. Clockwise move. You can't do Base adjust zero. Loudness. Now we set our loudness up. Plus eleven dB. When you turn it on. Let her set it. Let's do our so. loudness set plus eight dB. Clockwise. Loudness Clockwise. adjust. Subwoofer adjust. We'll set our plus sub up. two dB. Is your faithfulness to me? Let her set it. Subwoofer set. Now we're gonna set the crossover. Four dB. Up. Clockwise. Subwoofer adjust. Clockwise. Cl crossover adjust. Eighty five hertz. Crossover set 120 hertz. Now you can set that all up to fit your car in the noise. 
and then you can turn it off and turn it on. Right now it's on, and it will hold all them settings for you. All right, I'm gonna show you what it sounds like turned off. EQ set. EQ on. Loudness off. EQ off. There's a difference. Loudness off. EQ off. In the middle of my Loudness on. EQ on. When I'm in the middle of the road and I don't know which way to go, I still I'm still Everything to me. Exactly. It's all chirping. There <laughs> are. So that's how all that works. Uh, all this is in your instructions. Please read them. Have any questions, just call. That's why we like to, if we have to change this out, if it's bad, we like to put in a full-time fader. Auxiliary in. Take out your cord. Plug it in. Any device. Aux like phone, satellite radio, um, XM radio, CD changers, whatever it's got a head that puts out a signal. I had to have this with my new phone. So they don't have a headphone out jack, but this gives you a charging port and a headphone out jack. You can get these on eBay or at your phone at your phone store. Alright, bring it up. Let's go to music. I'm stronger than a locomotive, yeah, that old saying is true. Anytime you're on auxiliary and you want to go back to radio, just take your device and turn it off. You don't even have to unplug it. We're not even going to unplug that one. If you don't touch the radio in 20 seconds, it'll automatically go back to where you had it. If you want to go a little quicker, just turn it off and back on. All you're doing is shorten that 20 seconds down. We're going to let it automatically change over. Now, we didn't put any LEDs in here, and you don't have to. But this, this face cleaned up so good, and it looked so good, I hated to drill holes in there to put LEDs in. So I didn't put any in there. You don't really need them. Cause she will talk to you. That's your original 1948 Fleet Line with a basic Aurora Design conversion. I appreciate you letting me do it for you. Thank you.